Good morning, everyone, and welcome to this webinar. Uh, this is uh, the third webinar that I'm having, and every month I'm going to have with you all. So today's topic is uh, very important for our business, and it is about our industry. What is network marketing? And the agenda behind that thing is to understand what is the power of for your industry and how you're going to get benefit out of it. So first thing first, uh, this is uh, a webinar where uh, I would like you to think if you got a piece of paper or a pencil, uh, write it down, the answers that what do you understand by network marketing? I wish our, uh, our chat box was working, I could uh, see your answers but uh, it, it is not possible hmm, uh, to see your answer because the chat box is not working. So just think and, uh, and find out what you understand by network marketing. So the agenda of today's webinar is uh, to find out, define what is network marketing, you compare the job and the and network marketing uh, business, why it is a perfect opportunity and how and why the companies who are doing it, uh, they are marketing the product and what is the criteria to select the best net network marketing company. Now you're already already in the DXN and I'm sure there are a lot of people uh, in the audience who are new or who are, have been invited by some of the DXN members. So this webinar is not only for the members, but it is also for the newcomers or who don't know about DXN or the industry. So what is the purpose? There has to be a purpose of uh, all uh, talks. I would like you to listen to me carefully and I will give you the answer in the end. After you listen for to this webinar for about 45 minutes, you'll get an idea as to uh, why this webinar was uh, telecasted. So the question is, what is network marketing? So I would like to first of all clear uh, the misconcept that people think that network marketing is multi-level marketing. Multi-level marketing is a compensation plan. It is not the industry. It is not that business through which uh, you're getting the income. So please take that thing out that MLM is not the industry. Industry is direct selling or network marketing or referral marketing or word of mouth marketing. That is the name of the industry, not MLM. So now I will uh, define the word network marketing and what the leaders in the world are talking about. Starting from Paul Zane Pilzer, a great guy who had been uh, talking about network marketing industry. He was a professor in uh, New York University. And he says of all the entrepreneurial uh, opportunities available to today, whatever business, small business that people want to do, one of the most important is direct selling also called network marketing. So these are the two words uh, which are synonymous. Uh, one is uh, direct selling and the other one is uh, network marketing. The other person is of course uh, uh, the guru in the network marketing uh, industry, Tom Schreiter, a good, fr good friend of mine. And he says most people do network marketing every day. They simply do not get paid. So Again, while I'm explaining, you will get to know uh, why he has said that. And then comes uh, Stephen Covey, and I'm sure a lot of people know about this uh, great author, a motivational speaker. Um, he is on a very high level who had been uh, coaching people as high as uh, President Obama. And he is talking about network marketing has come of age. It is un deniable that it has become a way to entrepreneurship and independence for millions of people. Now people would like to do business but the problem is they don't have enough money and network marketing provides you an opportunity where uh, 
uh, a person with low income or a person who doesn't have big capital also can do uh, this business. I would very strongly recommend to to all of you all to buy this book. If you have bought the, this book and you have read it, again read it. And that is called The Seven Habits of Highly Effective People. When I'm talking about people, I'm not talking about the ordinary people. I'm talking about people who are higher up. And in our industry, network marketing, uh, since I'm involved so over 15 years in this industry, traveled to a lot of places, I have seen you know, you, those who are successful in this industry, uh, they are leaders. So these seven points that you're looking in front of you, uh, what uh, Stephen Covey talks about, uh, being proactive, begin with the end in mind, put first thing first, think when, when, seek first to understand and then to understood, synergize and sharpen the saw. And this itself, uh, you know, his workshop and his seminar takes not day, days to explain each and every point. I'm going to take out only one point and which is number four. Our business is a win-win business. You as a distributor, you as a business builder, what you do is you tell people uh, what they are looking for, what are their problems, what are their issues, their challenges, their dream, their ambition. So we have got uh, people whom you are talking to, they are prospects, and uh, they become uh, consumers, they become members, they become uh, uh, distributors, and then they become business builders. So whatever they have come to you for, you give the solution. So it is not only that you are trying to, you know, market your product or your business opportunity, but those people who are joining you, they are basically getting the solution to their issues, problems, or dreams. So when your network grows, those people who are joining uh, with the same dream, they would like to become healthy, they would like to uh, become successful, they would like to become a financial free people. So they win and you win also. So your network grows with a like-minded people, not that you get anybody and everybody into the business. So this is very important and in network marketing, this is the only industry in the world where I would say that there is a complete win-win situation. So who is it for this uh, network marketing business is for the people who love helping other people. It is a people's business. And you have to take care of the people who are uh, in your business or who are not in your business, who are consumers, you have to take care of them. And who are prospects, who are uh, not even part of your business, that you reach out to them and try to help them as much as possible. So my next exercise is uh, uh, you should be knowing, you know, what is the worldwide Today, as per the latest direct selling or network marketing data. So you're going out to the field, you should know, but more important is your knowledge about this industry is, is important. So the latest figure, this is as of June of 2016, uh, December 2015, they got the total revenue is $183.7 billion. And out of all that revenue which is generated worldwide, Asia Pacific is having 46%, America is 34%, Europe is 19%, and Africa and Middle East is only 1%. So you can well imagine, if you would like to grow your business, where you should be targeting. No doubt Asia is a huge market, it will still keep on growing, but where you are right now in the Middle East and some people in Africa, this is the place to uh, grow your business. How many people are involved? 103.2 million network marketers are involved. 
Again, if you see the uh, breakdown of those people who are involved worldwide, uh, 52 million is, is from Asia Pacific and US Canada is 21 million, South and uh, Central America is 14, Europe is 14.5, Africa and Middle East is just 1.7 million people. So once again, if you look at the figure, uh, that is the place that you should be focusing on to expand your business. Billions of dollars uh, countries or market right from 1 to 11 if you look at USA where the network marketing business started is number one with 20 percent China 19 uh, percent if and when DXN opens in China that is a place for you to focus on Korea 9 percent Germany Japan Brazil Mexico France Malaysia UK these are the top 10 uh, countries and rest of the world is 20%. You can well imagine so where you have to focus in those 10 countries if you have your uh, friends or relatives try to move into those areas to expand your business. So the world leaders opinion that what they are talking you should be having those quotes with you starting from uh, Bill Gates. I mean this is a very popular uh, uh, quote uh, that you should be telling to the people no less than Bill Gates is saying that if I would be given a chance to start all over again, I would choose network marketing. So that's how high he thinks about network marketing. Now I would like to uh, you know, compare the job that people do versus network marketing. Now everybody, most of the people are in job. Most of the people. So if you compare the income that you get in from the job that is fixed whereas from the network marketing is unlimited in job there is no financial freedom I mean people have worked for 20 30 40 and even beyond 40 45 50 years people are working and they cannot get that financial freedom total financial freedom can be achieved through network marketing you trade time to get that money here the leverage is you yourself the worst thing in the job is the income stops when you lose a job or you fall sick and your sick leave goes beyond and then your income stops here your income goes into residual income and in the corporate world and I have worked in the corporate world I know it even if your salary is good there is a glass ceiling and in our business of network marketing, there's no glass ceiling. And retirement is usually around 60 to 65. Whereas if you start uh, uh, the network marketing business at the age of 30, I guarantee you by age 40, in 10 years time, you can retire uh, from your job and you have the residual income coming in. So the, the, the way the job and the business world, the network marketing world works is, can you see the picture on the left side there's a lot of workload and sometimes these people bring the workload to the house also for example teachers I've seen a lot of teachers they work five days six days and even the seven day on the weekend they are working uh, on whatever is left over from the uh, previous uh, week there's hardly any time that people have that's a typical scenario if there's a working mom, she is all in a rush rush, then you go on the um, road, there is so much of traffic, rush hour, you're stuck in that traffic for hours and hours. Just in Dubai, people who are applying, who are traveling from Ajman or Sharjah to Dubai, they take at least one hour, minimum one hour going, one hour coming in the peak hours. Overwork, underpaid, overstress. That is the definition of job. So what is network marketing? Why network marketing? There is in your business there is no employee. You don't have to keep any inventory. You don't have to have a warehouse. You don't have to have a store. This is all being done by, by the company. No accounts payable. You don't have to pay anybody and you don't have to take any money from the people. And the best part is from the company you are getting the product directly whereas in the traditional business you have this 
distributor and then the wholesaler and then the advertisement and finally from the retailer you get the uh, product. So whatever the cost of the product is, whether it is just a simple pen, it may be costing say about uh, maybe 20 cents, you pay almost a dollar or if not dollar, at least 50 cents you are paying for this pen. So whatever the company saves, if you are marketing, you are promoting, you are going out and reaching out to the people, you get money and that's where the money is. So why you should be involved in network marketing, those who are new, this is for them, those who are already in the business, you have to you know, be very clear that you become your own boss. You work from home. Right now I am sitting in Vancouver, Canada, I am talking to people around the world. You first start as a part-time then you go into a full-time and if you are doing part-time you are doing a, having an extra income. You choose your own hours. I mean you don't have to work 9 to 5. You can want to work early in the morning, you want to work late night. You choose your hours. And that's uh, the way that you work. I mean you choose your hours from the comfort of the home and you can stop work go out and play, do something, come back, that's how you work. Basically. It is definitely a perfect opportunity. Why I say perfect opportunity is because whatever you want to have from inside your uh, entrepreneurial uh, skills, you can apply it. It is a business where there are no boundaries. It is a business which you can do with your loved ones. It is a business where you would like to help people, many people. It is not only the, 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 in the traditional business, it's only you, you, you. And that is what I usually talk about. You see, the word, if you look at, this is the word M, and it is only me. <laughs> if you reverse it, it becomes we. In our business, it is all about we. It is not about me. So when you, you are in a position to give to people, and that is where the joy of living is. You are not doing things only for yourself, you are doing for your community, for your uh, people, for your country, for people who are in need. So it is, a, it is a just business and when I say just, it is important to understand where you put in your hours. Now this is a typical uh, pyramid in a job. So if you look right down, there is hard working employees. They do not have any chance to become president or CEO of the company. They work hard, they become a supervisor or a team leader and with a lot of hard work they can go to the middle management and if they are extraordinary, they have you know upgraded their knowledge, they become vice presidents. This is, in my life I've seen a lot of people like that. No way, you know, a guy who's starting at the age of 25 or 30, right from the bottom of this pyramid, they can become a CEO. So, a lot of people ask me, I mean, is this a pyramid scheme? So, what I ask them back is, what do you mean by pyramid? Pyramid is in the job, it is in the government structure, in whatever big structure that you are looking at. Pyramid in the job is the top guy gets millions of dollars. If you look at these uh, CEOs and the president of big companies, their annual income goes over a million. Whereas those people who are working in thousands, they are just getting few thousand, two thousand, three thousand, maximum five thousand dollars per, per month. Now in network marketing, the pyramid is inverted. It is very, very different than the corporate job. There is no glass ceiling. So if you look at this picture that you are having, you start from bottom and the top position is empty. 
you work hard and you become the the president or the CEO, whatever rank in the corporate world is in our um, industry, in our uh, DXN uh, company, it is called Crown Ambassador. So anybody and everybody can reach to the top of Crown Ambassador. It might take maybe 10 years, 15 years, but it is worth it. It is really worth it because you are working not only for yourself, but for the people who are in your team. So this is very important. If somebody talks about pyramid scheme, show them the picture of the, the real pyramid, which is in the job world and how it is in our industry. So now looking at the potential of the network marketing in the Gulf and the world, why there is a big potential of uh, our industry in the Gulf. I'll just focus on the Gulf first and then I'll move over to the world. Most of the people who have come to the Gulf Middle East to, is to work and to earn money and save money. That is the only reason. And that is at a, at a very high cost. They have left behind their families and they are working here. Not for a year, for years they are working here. So it is important if you start your business over here, and you go back to your country, whether it is India, Pakistan, Nepal, Bangladesh, uh, Philippines, anywhere you have come from, you can definitely in three to five years time earn the same amount of money that you are earning from your job and go back home. And the best part of DXN is the one world, one market concept. It is so powerful that you are sitting in say Dubai or you are sitting in uh, Stockholm or you are sitting in Karachi or in Bombay any place from there you can expand your business globally and here it is important that you need to use the new technology you have to use the website you have to use the social media and be alive be visible tell people that this is what I have in, in, in my hand there is health and there is wealth. So if people would like to get connected with you, you have to have the right words. You have to have the right way to communicate with those people. So one world, one market concept, you know, is so powerful that you need not be uh, in one place to do the business. And the most important thing in one world, one market, uh, I have seen over, over 10 years of time being involved in expanding the business and seeing if you are in a country where there is affluence, there's a lot of people who are coming for a job and your business is booming and you just don't know the bubble can burst and that country can have a, a you know a civil strife or it can have any financial problem, economic problems. So if you have your business in other places, it's not everywhere the things are going to start. So sometimes the business goes down in some places, the other places is going to go up. So it is important that you make sure that your business is not restricted to one place, but it is expanded all over the world. So now this is another very important data, the why people join network marketing. This is the service which has been done that 51%, more than 50% of the people need extra income. That's why they join. And they join as a part-timer. 34% is full-timer. And that is where the big money is. That is where the financial freedom is. That is where the residual income is. 9%, they just want to buy the product in discount because they are consumers. And 6% people want to socialize with people. Today in this struggling economy, a lot of people are unemployed. So you can reach out to those people. Once again, you have to know the skill how to reach out to those people. Now, those people who are already with uh, DXN, who are already uh, doing that for marketing, hmm, they know what all are the important criteria to be part of this network marketing company. Those who are new or who are uh, not knowing what is network marketing, so for them, they should know what are the important criteria. 
first thing first you know you have to have a lot of products the products price is important then comes our business where the how much you need to start the business in DXN worldwide if you want to join DXN you join with no money online you can join register yourself when you want to activate your membership then you pay money and then you activate your membership so there are 16 criteria which I have written in my book you go through it read it and when people are talking to you you should be able to talk to them that these these are the power uh, points that we have so this is an exercise how many criteria can you write about DXN one two three four it should be about 15 or 16 of them and then find out which is your strongest criteria now coming to women in our industry of network marketing we have a big percentage of women involved over 80 percent we have a lot of women who are uh, working mom single mom they are women who are educated but because of the children they are stuck home women who are working um, who are working and they have to put their children to the daycare or uh, with their parents I mean you ask that mother how difficult it is to be away from a newly born child maybe the child the baby is even six months so she has to go back to work so if she is given an opportunity whereby she can make the same amount of money from home she would love to do, do that and that is the reason why I see a lot of women who are doing network marketing business from home whether they are highly educated or, or whether they are just normal housewives even housewives are adding that supplemental income to to that to the house so why women are successful in our business is because they know they can understand and what I say is they they have this sixth sense women love network marketing because they have that maternal instinct they get connected very fast compared to men and what people are not talking also they can understand that so our business focuses around how you get connected to the people and in that they have got the skill that's a natural skill that they have so in our business in network marketing it is important that you tell your story it is crucial that you should have a story story how the product has helped you story how the supplement income or this additional income is helping you nobody becomes uh, you know millionaire or they get financial freedom overnight most of the people are working they are working for five years ten years twenty years thirty years and if you ask them what is their what are their stories they'll say you know they're working that's it they're working for livelihood they're working every month every year year by year whereas if you really put your focus put your head down and start working hard I'm sure in five years time your income should be good enough to match your salary if not then you are doing something wrong so you should have a product story and you should have an income story so try to you know write your own story and the famous proverb goes fact tells story sells when you are talking too much about you know what is network marketing industry or what is DXN or how many countries these are all facts people don't get impressed they will you know just listen and that's it but once you talk about your own personal story from your heart 
that is the time people get connected. This story is similar to mine. So write your own story tonight or tomorrow and then be a good storyteller. So now coming to, now you cannot write in the chat box, unfortunately, what is the purpose of this entire uh, webinar that I have done? So it is on, based on belief. My entire this webinar of about almost 35-40 uh, minutes that I have taken is how to strengthen your belief. How can you go out and talk to the people if you yourself you're not sure about this in about this business, about DXN, about DXN product. You have to have a solid 100% belief in the industry. The moment there is an objection, there is a question and you don't have uh, the belief to answer those questions, I guarantee you, you will not survive in this industry. So the object, objective and the purpose, the main purpose for this uh, webinar today is to strengthen your belief. How, what is the, you know, how you think about this industry? This industry makes more millionaires than any other industry. It does not, you know, demand a highly educated person or a person who's very social, a person who's very popular, a person who's got a lot of money. We have seen a lot of ordinary people achieving extraordinary, you know, their, their life has changed completely. From ordinary, they have become extraordinary. So if you have that belief, and the, with that belief comes the passion. The passion has to be there. Only passionate people are really successful people. I'm not talking about a network marketing industry, a guy who's a musician, a guy who's a painter, or a guy who's a sportsman. They work day in and day out. Then only they reach to that cradle of uh, success. If you want to go really higher up, you have to believe in yourself. And after you believe in yourself, you have to believe in this network marketing industry and in our company, which is called DXN, which is growing so rapidly around the world. You see, I'm a, I, I just came back from uh, USA and Mexico. In Mexico, in my workshop, there were diamonds. And they were not normal diamonds. They were diamonds who were earning about $1,000 to even more than $10,000. Why did they come? Because they believed in this industry and they wanted to upgrade themselves. So you work on your belief and this belief will only work when you start using the product day in and day out and see how the product is working on you, number one. And number two, you know, you talk to many people, at least one or two people every day, uh, online, offline, and try to change their lives. So my entire today's webinar has come out from my book, Map Your Freedom. And uh, all questions, if you want to go back and read all those chapters which I've taken it out, this is not uh, just a one hour or 50 minutes uh, talk. This can go on for days and days. So the future of network marketing is by doing two things. And this is what I have been doing from last three months. Now my second edition of the book is coming, inshallah by next month. So you have to read a lot of books. Definitely you have to read a lot of books. And the other thing is, of course, you have to connect, get connected to people who are big in this industry. I've tried my level best and this will be, again, uh, a home study course. Because this is like if you want to do MBA, uh, you need to uh, put in just not four years. You have to put your BBA four years and then two years for your master's uh, postgraduate. That's how. And then only you get that money. So if you would really 
you know want to make this as a career as a as a full time business you have to invest in your learning if you don't learn you will not earn remember you have heard many a time learn and then only you can earn and learning has to be done through books from cds through all kinds of online courses that is happening all around the world so these two will be launched uh, by september of next uh, that is by 15th or end of the uh, september so that is all for uh, today